thought during the pandemic, oh, I don't know if I'm going to get to work again, so it's great to be here. Give yourselves a round of applause, coming out, seeing comedy again, supporting us. Thank you. Yeah. You guys are great. Because uh, I thought for a while I was going to have to crime, and I thought, fuck, what am I going to do to crime? And I knew exactly what I was going to do to crime. I thought, I'm going to start a moped gang. <laughs> but during the pandemic, during the restrictions, just had to be me. Moped gang of one. <laughs> I was going to lone wolf that shit. And I was like, I, got, I know what I'm going to do with my, my moped gang of one. I'm not going to get greedy. I'm not going to go after the diamonds and the gold on the high street. That's when they get you. I'm going to stay under the radar with my moped gang. I'm only going to steal people's fast food. Because <laughs> no one's going to bother calling that in, are they? And even if they do, what are the police going to say? Right, who are we looking for? Brown guy on a moped with takeaway. <laughs> Fuck, this is going to be a long case. IT, I got a, a soft spot for you. I used to, before I was a comedian, I used to do IT. And uh, if there's any other guys out there that w do IT and stay in IT, you're better men than I am. I couldn't do it anymore. I did it for a few years. And then just one day I woke up and I just got so sick of all the pussy. <laughs> I got sick of girls throwing themselves at me when they found out I did IT. <laughs> you know what it's like, man, just fucking drowning in pussy. <laughs> Just go to parties, talking to a girl, she's going really well. She goes, so what do you do for a living? And you have to be like, okay, don't freak out. <laughs> IT. And then they're like, oh my God, IT? Are you serious? <laughs> what are we talking, C++, Java, Visual Basic? What's going on, big boy? Oh. <laughs> IT, ladies, oh, stay away. <laughs> Joking, it's not a sexy job, is it, mate? No, no, no calendar for us, no. <laughs> Imagine that. Oh, check out Mr. July. He's fixing the printer. Mm. <laughs> mm. So sick of passwords, man. Passwords can fuck off. These days, the computer's like, I need a new password. You put something in, it's like, no, not like that. I want so anything you will never remember would just be fucking great. <laughs> Wasn't always like this. Remember the good old days? Years ago, the computer would ask you for a password, and you could put in dog, and the computer was like, nice one. <laughs> That's a really good... <laughs> Fuck, I'm showing my age here, talking about the heyday of passwords. You know when you feel old? You feel old when you hear someone much younger than you bitch about how old they feel. That's when you feel old. Like last week, I overheard this, this fetus. <laughs> just this little shit with his friends. He was just standing there going, guys, I feel I'm really old, man. Guys, I'm so old, I remember when Amazon was just a bookstore. I said, mate, I remember when it was just a fucking jungle, all right? <laughs> Notice young people are always going on about tonight. Young people are obsessed about tonight. Young people will be like, hey, what's happening tonight? What's the plan tonight? Where are we going tonight? You coming out tonight? We're going to have a great night. When you're old, you don't give a shit about tonight. Because when you're old, you have to worry about tomorrow. <laughs> old people spend all tonight worrying about tomorrow. When you're old, even try to go out the young people, you can always spot the old person. Because young people are at the bar at midnight taking shots, just going, whoa, yeah, I'm having a great night. Old people are taking those same shots going, what the fuck am I doing? I have so much shit to do tomorrow. What the fuck? <laughs> Notice for a young person, if a young person's got nothing to do tonight, it's the worst thing in the world for a young person. A young person will be like, I've got no plans tonight. I've got nothing to do tonight. Oh, I'm going to fucking kill myself. <laughs> it's a young person problem. Because when you are old and you have nothing to do tomorrow, oh my fucking God. <laughs> that is the best shit in the world. And I know I'm right because I can feel the old people fantasizing right now. 